A hailstorm has destroyed seven homes and the Agapi Foundation Mountain Miracle Primary School, turning lives upside down in an instant. Grace Achifeza, Kisoro District Woman Member of Parliament, visited the affected communities to offer her support and condolences. It took away all the roof, it, it threw it off, uh, but luckily none was hurt, all the children survived it, uh, but the roof went off right now as we talk. They are studying under no shelter. They are just in the structure but without a roof. And any time it rains, they will not be able to, 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 to study. there. So we call upon those concerned, the Office of the uh, Disaster Preparedness, to come to their rescue as they are in a dire need of, uh, of roofing. And uh, we are also continuing to go and see the different homes that also got affected. So it's, it's an emergency that needs uh, immediate attention. Chanika town clerk Miriam Tumheire, standing beside Honorable Achifeza, emphasized the need for immediate action. I to our Nyanavo Bantu, to an office, to Jacora report, to exchange the office at Aladisi, Patanje, and senior committee woman to Pisao and Jay and chairman. Kujirango to Jesam Office Ala DC, Kujango Abayovozi, Kujabele a yard stick, Kujango Eva to Savido Fasha, Kujango Government, Yuchiravan to Maku, Baduze Ichibazo Kitch. Mayor Erasma Sanyu echoed this commitment, underscoring the importance of coordinated efforts to rebuild. Uh, yesterday, we received bad news from relatives of Nyami Genda that a strong wind has hit several houses in the village. Then we learned to see what was happening. We reached Agape Foundation at Mountain Miracle. The roof of a classroom had been taken away by the strong wind. Similarly, some other houses near the border of Nyarusiza in Nyamijenda, or like four to five houses, all of the roofs had been taken. Reverend Joseph Ndachaisenga, the owner of the destroyed school, expressed relief that no children were harmed during the storm. Umiaga wishu heri waje ukuraho icho hejuru ujitanga hasi, ariko abana abaso kamobari gushimi mana, icho ni chambiri chotu kwa shimiri mana, kukimana, yabanyi na atkwe, idu hagararaho. Local leader Mzei Joseph Karasira, LC1 of Jambijenda, called on the government to provide urgent assistance. Meanwhile, Everest Nsabimana, a father of eight, described the challenges his family faces. Despite the devastation, the community of Chanika remains determined to rebuild, drawing strength from their shared resilience and hope for a better future. Story compiled by Kate Atuzarirwe for UBC News.